Hello, in this video, I'm going to discuss the basics of how to use Handbrake to crop and trim a video. So what you first need to do is to get a file. So what I'm going to do is click source here, and that will open up a file that I'm going to be editing. So this is just some videos. Let me um, just click one. I don't know, maybe this one. Okay, so now I have my file and this is preview button. So this right here will give me a little preview of the video. So if you're doing a really long video and you're doing certain edits, then sometimes it's good to be able to see the preview. So you can take a short preview. It'll make it very short to edit. I mean, to uh, render. So it'll be available for you to see. So in this video, I so that's the video. Um, so I want to discuss cropping and trimming. So if I'm gonna use cropping, I use this. And so this right here um, will allow me to crop. So if this right here will cut away pixels from the right side and the left. There's a video in the description of how to crop and trim. I just wanted to show how to do that with the preview. So this is what it is now, preview. So in this video, I wanted to illustrate some of the bugs that can happen in this app. So what you see is that, you see how it's cut off on this over here? It's because I cropped it. If I wanted to cut it even farther, then I can just fool around with the numbers. So if I want to crop this little region right here, I would just go farther and you could you could just do it that way. Um, the other thing you wanna do is you want to change how long, so this is trimming. Do you wanna change how long in the video it is? So maybe I wanna skip into 30 seconds through some other time. And then you preview. So in this video, I wanted to illustrate. You see how it started in the beginning? It's because when I clicked started preview, it started at a certain time. So let me just click a random time like for the middle. It is not showing the preview time up here. Let's do the two. And let's actually not do any division if we don't have to. So you can see from there, the preview and has the crops. So in the description of this video, I will have some links to other videos, which quite honestly explain it a little better. Um, I just wanted to show how to use the preview because neither of the um, videos that I have attached have that. I didn't see anybody talking about using the preview to see exactly what you're doing. Um, one specifically mentioned something about seeing a picture preview, but not a video preview. So um, once you do that, you can click start to fully make the video that you want. So this is what 30 seconds through 40 seconds. So this right here is down here. It's very quick because it's a short video, but if it's a long video, that's why preview is important because you want to see exactly where you're cutting it. Otherwise you'll have to wait for the whole video to process. So you're gonna see where it saved it. So it saved it in this folder, this directory in here, where it says destination. So I would need to go and to open that uh, file area up and then um, check to see that it looks like the way I want it to. That's all I wanted to say. Hope you have a nice day.